Hello everybody, it is October 18th, and if you don't already know from following along on social media and other advertisements, it is the day that the McDonald's Happy Meal Halloween Buckets are back. Now I know a lot of you guys probably got these buckets when you were younger, in your childhood, or things like that, you've seen them over the years, but McDonald's actually decided to redo them this year, re-release them in nine different versions. So there's three different colors. I believe there's a white ghost, an orange jack-o'-lantern, and a green witch, and each of them have three different faces. So there's nine of them total so what we're doing is we're actually going to be going to as many different mcdonald's today as we can we're going to try to get at least three of them we want to try to get one of each color see if we get any extras if we do get any extras then we're just going to do a giveaway with them all right we're pulling up to the drive through now as you can see they just wrapped up doing the disney cars on the road from the disney plus series half meal toys i was able to get all eight of those i'll have to do a video about that sometime in the rest of my collection but we are here for the happy meal halloween buckets today all right here we go welcome to madonna's what can i get for you hi i had a quick question for you if you don't mind do you guys have the halloween happy meal buckets today yeah we do uh what color do you have here uh we have white all right, could I get one of the Halloween Happy Meal buckets with a hamburger? And I have a uh, code from the app, if that's all right. You're welcome. And then what's the code? Uh, the code is 3634. Okay, I got you. All right, thank you so much. You're welcome. First one, though. So if you don't have the McDonald's app, we just got this Happy Meal totally for free. I had 6,200 points and it's 6,000 points to get a free Happy Meal. So download the app and you can build up points along the way. They said they have the white bucket, as you probably heard, which means they have the ghost one here. So that's one out of our three that we've got to get today. Now we'll just wait and see what face it is. So Summer actually did a little digging on the history of the Halloween buckets. Can you tell us what year did the Halloween bucket start? 1986, and then they made a return appearance in 2016. The names of them are the McBoo, the McPunkin, and the McGoblin. All right, so it is a goblin, not a witch. I was mistaken. It has a little witch hat, so it's a little deceiving. It but... looks like a witch. I don't know why it's the McGoblin. I don't know. But but... McWitch, I maybe. Mc McGoblin. Thank you. Let me get you a straw. All right, thank you so much. All right. Okay, so we got our McBoo bucket here, the one with the ghost. I was mistaken. I saw a picture online of the nine different faces, but each one of the buckets actually has all three faces around. I just couldn't see that online. So I guess there's only three buckets. So I wanted to correct that, which makes it easier for us to just get three of them. But I was also, I thought they had lids, but they don't. It's actually just this little thing here on the handle. As you can see, all of the food is down inside and they give you the drinks separately, of course. It's really nice. It's a lot thicker than I thought it was. And it also comes with this set of stickers and there's a little activity set on the back where you get to dress up these skeletons with the clothes on the front one of them's a pirate one of them's a ghost so it's kind of cute all right so i'm gonna start with the hamburger here i have the fries as well i like the hamburger happy meals they also do offer them with four and six piece chicken nuggets I actually, it's a little story time. I remember my very first Happy Meal, believe it or not. It was in 2002. My mom took me to get the Peter Pan Return to Neverland Happy Meal toy. And we ended up going around to like five or six McDonald's to try to get all of the toys. Because what it was, was it was a pirate ship set. And each one was a different character in the movie with a different section of the ship. So you could put them all together. I have it in storage now, but I'll put it up on the screen so you guys can get a look at it. But that one was my favorite Happy Meal set by far. And that was the first one that I collected all of them. So that was really where it got started, I guess, 20 years ago. Not never gets old. So that concludes the first Happy Meal. This was at the Winter Garden McDonald's. So I think now we're gonna head down to Windermere, Florida, just about 10 minutes down the road. And we're going to check out the McDonald's that they have down there and see if we can't find the green and orange buckets. So here we are outside. Because the drive through line was so long, I did decide to go into this one. So I'm not gonna film inside, just because I wanna be respectful of staff members and the other customers and things like that. But I will show you once we get outside, I'm gonna go in and ask what color bucket they have. So unfortunately, this one was a miss. They do not have the other colors. They only have the white one, the McBoo, that we already got. So we're gonna head about 10 minutes down the road and try again. Okay, McDonald's number three, we're heading inside now. This one is down more towards Horizon West, Florida, again, about 10 minutes away. We'll see, hopefully they have the orange or green bucket here. They have the green bucket here. Okay, so we found out that they have the green ones behind the counter here, so I'm gonna mobile order, screen order. I don't know what they really call this. But we have another free Happy Meal from Summer's app. So we're gonna use that today. Here we go, okay. 
So, oh, we can get the six piece nugget for free, even though it's normally more expensive. Mm. I'm gonna do that one. Here we go, tangy barbecue. And then we want the Halloween pails. All right, so we got another zero, zero, zero. This, we've saved almost $10 today just by using the app. So thankfully we actually found a quiet little place here in the back, so we were able to film a little bit for you guys without disrupting anybody or being disrespectful. But here I'm gonna flip it around and show you the food for a second. Okay, so here it is, we got the green Mick Goblin half a meal bucket. Those are the stickers. Looks like this one is a witch and a werewolf you can decorate these skeletons with. Summer, how are the fries? Tasted the same as the last. No, what? That's the beauty of McDonald's. Let's see what we got in here. So we've got the stickers. We've got, oh, I forgot I got McNuggets instead of a burger. That's exciting. And we got Summer's Apple Juice all for free. We also got a tip from another collector who was here about where we can find the third and final color, and it's actually at the Walt Disney World McDonald's over by Animal Kingdom. So after Summer wraps up eating here, we are going to head that way. So Summer, do you think that they will actually have the orange bucket by the time we get to the Disney McDonald's? Yeah. I definitely think so. All right, here we are at the coolest McDonald's that I have ever been to. As you can see, it is right here in the heart of Walt Disney World over by the All-Star Resorts in Animal Kingdom. Oh, and I just saw somebody walking out with those orange McPumpkin buckets. So this McDonald's has a huge roof, a covered driveway. Everything up here on the roof is solar panels. They actually, in the pre-COVID era, they used to have bikes out front. They were like stationary bikes that you could actually pedal to like help continue the green energy of the store. But we're heading inside now. This is so cool. Oh, Summer's going to touch the wall over here. They've actually got like an outdoor sitting area. Like this is like a McDonald's with a patio. Oh, and they still have the stationary bike. Summer, come on. We gotta go pedal. All right. So I'm trying to work off the last two Happy Meals and also generate enough energy to cook the hamburger I'm about to buy. Gotta keep going. Feel the burn. Oh my gosh, Summer just realized that you pedaling actually lights up the golden arches. You can't see it a lot because it's daytime. But here, stop pedaling. And they're gonna turn off in a second. All right, we're gonna go inside and check it out now. Wow, it's just as cool inside. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we actually have one more. It's a 20% off, and he purchased a $1 more. So we got two free ones today, and now we're about to get this one for 20% off. So three Happy Meals for 80% the price of one. Look at this, this is like a kid's area here. I can't get over how aesthetic, like the counter and everything looks like. This is like a McDonald's from the future. Even the tables here, like, it's just so cool. I just love how futuristic and environmental everything here is. Look at this, they've got designated recycling areas for all the plastic. That's just so cool. They also only have paper straws. Summer just got a seat here at the light-up table. I think you can touch it, yep, and it changes colors. Oh, that's cool, I didn't even know. Yep, they have one of these in my hometown. It was not this cool, but it's really awesome. So we're gonna be sitting here to enjoy our food just a second. We got them all. All right, show us the stickers for this one. Ooh, this one we've got a pumpkin and a scarecrow. Super cute, you can put them on the skeleton just like the other ones. Oh, and look, they even have, we got the little fry container in here. That's adorable, it's like for an American Girl doll. So, Summer just mentioned what I was thinking also, and that is that it was way easier to get all of these buckets. It only took us like, what, two and a half hours maybe? To find them all, but I know we do live in Orlando. Obviously, we have a plethora of McDonald's in the general vicinity, so it may take you a little longer to find them in your hometown. But we're gonna sit here and eat, but before I do that, I wanted to share with you guys a little bit of Disney's history with McDonald's as we are in the only McDonald's left in Walt Disney World. Walt Disney was actually war buddies from World War I with Ray Kroc, who was not the founder of McDonald's, but he was the founder of the McDonald's Corporation. And back in the day, he actually asked Walt Disney if he could put a McDonald's in Disneyland Park. Walt said no because he didn't feel it fit the theming, but later on, Disney did come to an agreement with McDonald's in the 1990s, and they actually had fry stands in each of the four parks here in Florida. They built this full-size McDonald's here, and there was one at Disney Springs. Unfortunately, the deal fell through later on, but in recent years, we've started to see more Disney Happy Meal toys, more promos between Disney and McDonald's, and hopefully a rebuilding of that partnership, because it is so beneficial for everybody involved. This is adorable. I can't get over how cool this is. I can't believe we got them all so quick. 
Well guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll be here enjoying our food, and we'll see you next time. Leave us a comment about some more of the content that you'd like to see on the channel, and enjoy your happy meals.